hi guys welcome to my channel welcome to my channel this is pidre as you know in this channel we used to drop daily analysis on boom and crash and step in this uh, if you're watching this channel for the first time can you subscribe to this channel and click on the notification button to notify you when next i drop my next video uh, you can also comment and share your experience on this video you can also comment and like it and also i have my telegram group you can also join to meet some pro like you and for free signal so today i'm going to introduce you to another strategy that is working i call this strategy top down analysis because it's going to analyze your trade on higher time frames and it's, it's going to give you an entry on a low time frames you understand like you're going to have your analysis on four hour time frames and you are going to have your entry at uh at lower time frames maybe five minute time frames or 15 minute time frames so um so with the help of this uh window one which i have at this particular side so i have the combination of my ris rsi i have my macd and i have my uh, ma which is the moving average so um let me show you the settings before i explain how this really works so from the settings i have my i have my moving average i have my moving average on my main chart which is the uh, the period of 60 i have shift of zero i have method to be simple apply to close i have my style in my in black color so you can have that in any of your color then you press undone so in my window one i have my relative strength index so in my relative strength index, I have my period to be 14. I have applied to close. I have my style to be in background color of my phone. So if you are using black background, you can also have that in your as a, as a you can also have it at the background of your phone. So you use black. So I have the level. I have only two level, which is 90 and 10 level. So which indicates my buy and selling zone. So you press undone. So you have you move to your MACD. So on my MACD, I have my first EMA to be 12, my slow EMA to be 26, I have MACD X MA to be 9. I have applied to close. So style, I have these two color. So you can also choose any color of your choice. And you press undone. So I have a moving average in the parameter of period of two. I have the shift to be zero method to be exponential. I have applied to be to be previous indicator data so i have the style to be in also black color so no level so you just press on done so by doing this we have this full indicator on your phone and how you can trade using this particular indicator so by showing you analysis on high time frames for you to take your trade in low time frames so this is as you see this is crash 1000 on four hours time frames it work for every boom and crash index it work on boom 1000 it work on boom 500 it work on crash 1000 and also work in crash 500 it's also working crash and boom 300 you see this analysis so i'm going to show you how it really works so what you are only going to look for is the level of my 90 at this particular level and you're going to look for an entry in my what in my 10 level so in four hour time frames what we are going to be looking for is going to be this particular period so it's going to be when my moving average and my MACD join together to to have a move on my 10 level you see it indicate that the market is going on the up trend you see it is as it respected on the long term like uh, frames here on four hour time frames same thing also happen here it's it matched together at this period of 90 and it showed me that the trade is what is coming down so as you see now in four hours time frames it respect that particular level so what you are going to be marking now in in your four hours time frames you are going to be marking every angle that the two match together so you are going to go to your object and select your favorite object to mark that particular zone down so you are going to mark it down the where they cross each other you are going to be mark it down so from this trade now you know that everything you'll be taking on this trade is when your moving average uh is below the mark day so you are going to go to your five minute time frames now let's go to five minute time frames to check so we are going to be checking our 
we are going to be checking uh, where we indicate in five minute time frames so let's see so I'm looking for the for what I've used to demarcate it so uh, so yes we have it here so what you're looking for every time now is when your moving average went below the mark day so uh, as we see now we have indicated that particular joint in long frame in four hours time frames and um, what we are going to be looking is when the uh, when the moving average went below the mark day you see this particular zone is what we are going to be using and by taking up to five to ten candle then you are out of the market so you can also find so each zone we was we have this particular zone so when they are when the moving average went be, below the mark day, then you can come up to like five to ten candle then you are out of the market so this thing happen it repeat himself several times it's repeated time to time so when you, you see same thing also happen at this level the same thing happen at this level you see so you can easily take up your 10 to 5 candlestick every time so you can easily do that and move the market and move away from the market so same thing also happen at this particular level <laughs> five to ten can you stick then you are out of the market so it's happen time to time you see it also happen here so since you have market on high time frames which is four hours time frames so you can come to your five minute time frames or you come to your 15 minute time frames then you count your five candle every time then you take it so let's also check what is happen in boom 1000 same thing happen in boom 1000 in boom 1000 same thing is happen in boom 1000 you can see now I have a trade that is running in boom 1000 but don't let us see that so you look for an entry you look for that on high time frames which is four hours time frames and you indicate it out you 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 indicate it out there so on my four hours time frames and you see I have a trade at this particular level which indicates to me that I'm going to be taking what a spike so a spike is going to favor me on a lower time frames this time around so uh, what i'm going to do now is that i'm going to hang i'm going to go into lower time frames which is my five meaning time frames to find what i have i have identified so now we have it here on five minute time frames on boom 1000 so you see what you are going to be looking for all the time now is for you to take a spike and that is when the moving average went below the mark day at this particular level you see you see that spike so you keep on looking for that zone all the time so anytime your moving average cross your or uh, your mark day, then you know that a spike is what is coming then you what you take this particular spike so it's happen it also happen the same thing also happen here you see that particular zone you say you see that so it keep on what it keep on moving from that to do what to higher level you see that so uh with this strategy you can easily make a lot of profit with this so if you check your high time frames of four hours you identify it there then you come to your lower time frames to take up your trade every day and every time so if you're watching this channel kindly subscribe to my channel and like and comment on this video and join my telegram group for free signal thanks